Hello Marvel Strike Force fans, this is your friend the Fast and Comic Guy here, and today is day 10 of Dark Dimensions 3. I'm having a very hard time starting out. Because every single person here seems to have a one-shot mechanic. This is the third time on here. So I tried it a first time. Phoenix did her stealth, and they killed her, made her Dark Phoenix, and then killed her again right afterwards. Second time I didn't use her stealth and they one shot Minerva, one shot Hela, one shot Scientist Supreme, then killed Greg, then killed Phoenix, Spider Man, and then Dark Phoenix. And every single one of them was a one shot. Before I even got a chance, like I basically did two attacks and then everyone was dead. So I'm not sure what to do here. Because I should be allowed to do stuff. Like, watch. And. Oh. That'll be Phoenix. Oh. They didn't want. This isn't going to be good. Leave Greg alone. Leave Greg alone. No! Was I quick enough? Don't think so. Yeah. So that wasn't fun. Node 3 is going to be freaking hard. Oh. Yeah. Node 3 is going to be freaking difficult. Okay. Well. I hope that was laughably, horribly sad <laughs> for you all. By sad, I mean like just sadly funny, so. Well, well, before I go, why don't I, uh. So I'm saving up all these, uh, for when Ebony Ma comes out. Hopefully, I'll get some good. I'll try some seed theory. I'm saving up all these guys for a big opening at the very end of the event. This guy, I got a free orb from him recently, and he gave me another six. So. Out of all the ones I open up for that dwarf, I got pretty much the bare minimum that you can get, so RNG is not with me on there. Uh, I actually had two of these, and I had really horrible characters. I got Ant-Man and Storm. Well, Storm is okay, you know, if you need her, but I didn't need her. And I was just like, Ant-Man, I don't even want him to create ultimate shards. So, huh. I guess it is what it is. More ultimate shards. Cool, cool. Just what I was hoping for. Let's see? Today's offers are pretty horrible. Alright, so I got this one. One of them, as you can see. It helped me out a lot, because all I needed it was just to get her up to a fourth star, which was a red star. So, basically she went from 43,000 to over 51,000. And I was like, okay, that's nice. Although it would be nice if uh, when Fox next uh, gives it to you, unconsensually, it would be nice if they use some loop over here. Because five, 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 five. For 40 bucks. Like, don't even bother giving me these, basically. Just, you know, well, like, give us like 25 of each of these. Or give me like a whole bunch of the ABCs, like that I would love. Just give me a whole bunch of ABCs. Don't even bother with the other things. But you know, make it a little bit worth more while than just basically 50 of those. 
These are trash, never get these. I got it once just to see, just to test it out. And all I got were skill. A million gold over the course of a week for $21. That's pretty horrible. I wouldn't do that either. Just because I feel like if they give you a million gold over the course of a week, it should be, like this should be maybe a million gold if you, 21 bucks for a million gold up front. Like right here and there. Right here, now, give it to me. But a million gold over the course of a week, I feel should be about 55 bucks. Maybe. Uh, four star, guaranteed four star. Don't know what it's going to be, and it's for almost 30 bucks. No, I wouldn't do that, that's garbage. Ah, uh, dwarf support, save 70% on this amazing offer. Get 100 shards of Doctor Strange, Groot. So basically none of these characters I like, I don't want her. Really? Like, no one wants Night Nurse. Doctor Strange, maybe. Groot, yeah, if you need him still, possibly. And our good buddy here, Yondu. Now, I wouldn't do this one either, just because Yondu's fallen off the map. He, like, he's pretty cool, Doctor Strange, but maybe not just because Supernatural isn't a meta team as much as it once was. Like, still is a really great team, but, eh. Forest Glaive, yeah, sure, if RNG, if you still need them, and uh, you're pretty close to, like, one more star, maybe go for it. Uh, again, this is one of those uh, offers where it's like, give us a little bit better stuff besides 555, and if you still need him, uh, this, don't even bother, like, come on, get these in the event. Me, I buy these, unfortunately, but if they're garbage, I don't recommend them. This, this is always garbage. Never buy red star orbs. These are in case you screw up in a war, and you're embarrassed, and you don't want anyone to see that you lost horribly. <laughs> these are garbage. This is garbage. Garbage, garbage. 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 Horrible. No. <laughs> um, oh, wait. This is for Omega? Oh, pretty bad still. I wouldn't spend that much force. Amazingly bad. Just god awful. Terrible. Never, never. Bad, bad. This is 50 individual pieces. Not 50 of these. Not 50 of these. Like, it was like 50 of these? Maybe. But no, it's 50 individual pieces. So, yeah, I wouldn't do that. You need like a thousand of these to rank up one character to 14. And you do run out really quickly. So, that is a trash offer. Like, if you need so many of these to get a character to tier 14 gear, at least make the amount that you get ridiculously high. Like, do the math, be like, alright, well, you need like 50% more, so we'll give 50% more. Again, trash. This is just like that one up there, it'll give you just skill if you don't, it'll give you the character that you don't want. And so that's trash. Horrible, horrible. Oh yeah, gold. Yeah, horrible. Horrible, horrible. Yeah, so that's that. So guys, I thought if you thought that was fun and entertaining, please hit the subscribe button on the left. And check out one of my other videos on the right. Have yourself a good day, a good night, and a good morning. Peace.